What's up guys? It has been an entire year since I created this channel and you might have been wondering why haven't I posted a video? Well, here in Italy, ski resorts have been closed, but the winter of 21, 2022 is here. And as you can see, I'm riding the chairlift. We're headed up to the top. And today we are skiing at Fulgaria. It's my first time here and conditions today look like they're gonna be pretty good. It's beautiful. So let's hit the slopes and have some fun. very early in the season. As you can see, they've got some snow making equipment out and they're still grooming this run here next to me for the first time this year. Last night, it snowed almost a foot, but prior to that, there wasn't a whole lot of snow, which leads me to a great point about Fulgaria. The thing with Fulgaria is it's low in elevation and it's not far up into the mountains. So therefore snow conditions can be a little iffy sometimes, which is why even though I've lived here for two years, I still have not yet been. It's because I always just wanted to drive that extra 30 minutes to an hour in order to get to the better resorts that are at higher elevation. And on top of that, you can get to other resorts like Cortina or Araba, Marmolada, Madonna di Campiglio, and you're really up in the heart of the Dolomites surrounded by these epic mountain views. Don't get me wrong, it's spectacular here, like you can see behind me, but it is more similar to the United States and what you might find on the East Coast or maybe even some parts of the Midwest. Great skiing, nonetheless, I'm having an awesome day here. And I guarantee that if you come here on a day when conditions have been good and there's a good snow base and it's not too warm or anything like that, you're gonna have a good time. This is a great place to bring a family or maybe a beginner intermediate skier that's still looking to expand and develop their skills this is the spot to go for sure now it's possible you've seen my skiing videos before however you may not realize that right now you're watching me on a different channel i split my channel into two different channels so i've got global trail guide which is just mountain biking now and then this channel which is global trail guide ski so if you want to see more videos of skiing locations here in italy and other places throughout europe then be sure to subscribe to the channel that way you can stay up to date with all the latest videos that i've been putting out having an awesome morning on the slope so far gonna take a quick break but let's pop inside for a nice hot chocolate and a croissant Fun fact about hot chocolates here in Italy, they mean hot chocolate. It's literally just chocolate and it's melted down. It's so sweet and so good, but it is thick. Perfect combo though to help warm me up. This is a good break, let's head back up. I think I just found my favorite run of the day. This one right here. It is like an in-between of a blue and a red. It's nice and wide and oh, you can carve it up just like this person's doing right now. Snow is in really good shape right now. Let's go get it. one thing about Fulgaria and that is it's really easy to confuse the name with a couple other resorts. There's three different resorts that all share really similar names. Fulgaria, where I am now, Fulgarida, which is also known as Val de Sole in the summertime up near Madonna di Campiglio. And then in addition to that, there's Floria, which is a section of Cortina di Impezzo. So you got to pay close attention to that. Either way, all three are great places to ski. So 
this is another first for me. I came from that lift over there, but I need to get up this hill that you can see behind me. And they've got a nice little magic carpet here to take you to the top. So let's hit this magic carpet and I'll tell you a little bit more about Fulgaria along the way. So even before I discovered this magic carpet, I thought that the layout of Fulgaria was kind of interesting. It was clear that a lot of the lifts kind of serve individual sections and areas, but they didn't connect together the best. And this magic carpet is a perfect example of that. However, it's still a way up and I'm not complaining about it. Happy to be out here skiing today. Just wanted to point out that it's interesting and if you're trying to stick together with family or friends and you're all of different abilities and skill levels, it might be a little bit more challenging than some areas. So you just want to plan ahead for that. Other than that, definitely enjoying the day. Let's hit some more runs. here to appreciate the wonderful and beautiful Italian uh, chalets and different buildings that they always have on the side of the mountain. It's so awesome to have an opportunity to ski here in Europe. It's always so much fun. The terrain's amazing and I gotta say Fulgaria is a lot bigger than I thought it was. I've been skiing all day now hitting different runs the whole entire time and I'm actually lost. I don't know where I am at the moment but we'll figure it out and I'll find the car eventually. is going to be it for our day here at Fulgaria. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and tell me where to ski next.